Safi mtazamaji sasa jana Jumamosi alipumzishwa mchekeshaji Ochonjo kule Kisumu na jalango alikuwa miongoni mwa watu ambao walifika pale kwa ajili ya heshima za mwisho na mambo kama hayo. So <laughs> kuna kitu kimoja nimegundua hata kabla sitakupa hiyo story. Jalango siku hizi anakuwa na muda mgumu sana kujieleza anapotembelea Luo Nation. Yaani ikifika point lazima ajieleze akienda Luo Nation then inamaanisha watu hawajakubaliana na kitu ambacho alikifanya. You understand? Na mimi nataka nimwambie Jalango personally. Hata ukiwa na milioni ngapi? Hata ukiwa na mahali ambayo inatosha naje. You did the wrong thing. Ulifanya kitu kibaya alafu ukatuprove kwamba you don't care. Sasa kutuprove kwamba you don't care hapo ndo uliharibu kila kitu. Kutoka ODM hakuna mtu ambaye anakatazwa kutoka ODM ama kutoka azimio. But kutoka na kuonyeshana kwamba sasa wewe ndo eh wewe ndo pro, wewe ndo unajua. Ukiulizwa unasema wewe ulitengeneza mali yako kitambo. You don't care whether utachaguliwa ama hautachaguliwa tena. Hiyo ni madharau kubwa sana. Kama ulikuwa na mali, kama ulikuwa vizuri, aunge wa, waambia wakupe kura zao. Eh, ungeachana na Raila ashughulikie watu wengine, support watu wengine. Ali waste time yake kukusaidia wewe. Issue hapa sio mali ama nini. Uli waste time ya mtu fulani. Kukupigania upate nafasi after baada umepata nafasi. Unanipata after umepata nafasi unaruka ruka huku nje namna ambavyo wewe ushatengeneza mali you don't care whether utapata tena au kupata tena jalango i'm telling you unaweza ukafikiria wewe ulifanya vizuri lakini haukumfanyia vizuri Raila Amku, au hata wewe mwenyewe nakumbuka kuna kipindi fulani alikuwa nani unaona huyu jalango let me tell you kuna story ya mjui huyu the same same jalango alimtoa masauti ama utile brown yani kutoa na manisha aliwasaidia ku, ku, kujulikana kimziki you understand ikafika wakati otile si ni otile ama masauti mtajaribu ku confirm vizuri ya yeah? but uh, uh, si ni i think hebu acha nizungumzie masauti ama otile wacha nizungumzie otile brown ikafika point kuna kama ku, ku, mavrutano mvrutano fulani kwamba huyu mtu nilimtoa but sasa hivi hataki kusiku kunisikiliza sina nini sina nini na mambo kama hayo so wewe ulimsaidia akikataa kukusikiliza unaona vibaya kwa sababu ulimsaidia ndo the same same way Raila na feel akikuona unajaribu kumuonyesha you don't care whether ulitoka au kutoka jaribu tu kukaa chuti chini piga hesabu zako huyu ni mtu ambaye amekupigania for the first time umeingia ukawa MP hata kama una mali umebarikiwa kiasi gani ulitakiwa kumheshimu Raila Odinga hata kama ni kutoka kufanya kazi na Ruto haungetupa maneno haungeonyesha kwamba you don't care inawezekana hutaki msaada tena hautaki kusaidiwa ndio tusawa tu, tumekubali wewe una kila kitu but heshima ni kitu kikubwa sana heshima ni kitu kikubwa sana na itakusumbua Demo naendelea kutembelea hizi sehemu. Najua sio lazima ukuje Luonesho na nini. Ndio kwenu ndio lakini najua sio lazima pia ukuje. But unaona unapoenda sehemu unajieleza, unaanza kujieleza, oh mimi sikutoka, oh mimi sina ubaya, oh mimi nini. Jalango. I'm telling you for free. Sikuchukii siku, lakini ulifanya vibaya. Hapo hata we mwenyewe unatakiwa kukubali. Now Langata MP Felix Odiwor, popularly known as Jalango, was today forced to defend himself after one of the mourners criticized him over his allegiance to President William Ruto at a burial in Kisumu County. The MP also named the party he will use come 2027 election. And pate akajaribu ku, ku defend nini nini na mambo kama hayo. After picking the microphone to address the crowd at a burial of um, apana sio tiktoker eh? uh, ni uh, i think ni ni comedian dan kan ocho ochinjo but ni ochonjo in yakach constituency jalango hit at a critic who alleged say that he was paid to support president william ruto's government but kwa nini jalango waga anakataa kulipwa kwani atumjui ruto ni nani tutajuaje ya kulipwa 
e wacha sisi tu, tu, tu sisi tunaamini hivyo aye so long as wewe uko huko sisi tunaamini hivyo He, kwa sababu tunamjua Ruto ni mtu aina gani uwezi ukatuchanganya jalango eh uwezi kuja uwezi ukaja hapo ukatuambia e, e. kama huku lipwa wewe tuambie ulifanywa nini kwa nini ulienda huyo mtu hakuna kitu ambacho alikusaidia nayo kwenye 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 uchaguzi wa mwaka 2022 na there is nothing anakusaidia nayo mpaka sasa hivi hakuna hizo barabara ambazo unarakisha una rakisha huko kujenga hizo ambazo zinabomoka bomoka, bomoka hizo usiseme eti kwamba umepewa na William Samuel Ruto hakuna mtu ambaye amepewa William na, na, na hakuna mtu ambaye amepewa pesa na William Samuel Ruto nenda ukatengeneze barabara sehemu huyo William Samuel Ruto anashindwa hata kulipa walimu hapa anashindwa hata kulipa madaktari anatoa wapi pesa ya kukupea uende utengeneze barabara langata kwani wewe ndio MP peke yake kwani wale magavana wa, wa Mount Kenya ambao wanalia kwa nini wasipewe na Ruto wao si ndio walimpa Ruto kura wewe ulikuwa wapi ni gadhi yesi alisema nyinyi ndio mpate mtakuja baadaye wewe unataka kutuambia eti Ruto ndo ana, anafanya unajenga una, una mabarabara huko huko Langata. Acheni upumbavu bwana. Hakuna mtoto mdogo hapa mnataka kuchanganya changanya hapa. Eti mimi nilienda kwa sababu ya development. De, de, development gani unaona MP wanaenda kuchukua? Kama MP tu wa Mlima Kenya wanalalamika wana wanalia. Wa Mount Kenya huko kwa Kinarigadi wana, wanalia kila siku hapa hawajapata pesa hawajapata pesa. Kwani wewe ulipewa kama nani? Wewe ambaye ulikuwa unaambia una jeshi la baba jeshi la baba wewe unapewa kwa sababu uli, uli? eti ulifanya nini Wewe kama unataka kujipendekeza kwa Ruto endelea kujipendekeza kwa Ruto so it's, it's okay In fact Raila alisema hao watu wanafaa warudi kwenye uchaguzi Unatoka ODM unawachaga una mpaka ticket Wacha mpaka ticket wewe rudi huko uchaguliwe upya sio kuja kutuambia hapa uko na mali. Mali enda, mali mzako bibi yako, watoto wako na mama yako na, na watu wa kwenu. Hizo hazitusaidii. Mali zitakusaidia wewe. But ulipoteza muda wa mtu mzima kama Raila Odinga alafu unamuonyesha madharau. Hapo ndo hatuwezi tukakubaliana. Hapo ndo hatuwezi tukakubaliana. Eh. Hey. In fact mama ambaye alishout hapo ulilipwa yuko too right unless improve Eh mprova huko lipa. Ulilipa, ulilipwa. Sasa mprova huko lipwa. The Langata MP claimed that he made his wealth long before joining politics and that money cannot make him switch political sides. <laughs> he fearlessly pointed out at the lady who had allegedly attacked him at the funeral and vowed to give her money to prove that he cannot be bought. <laughs> so mtu anaambiaga jalango So yani jalango ana feel like ako na mali mpaka tena hawezi akakubali pesa nyingine tena. Mm-hmm. We? Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Na, yani najaribu tu kufikiria. Yani jalango jalango alafu anapendaga hii point. Ya mimi nilitengeneza mali yangu kitambo. So lazima nipewe pesa. Bro dadangu hakuna binadamu ambaye anatosheka na pesa hakuna binadamu ambaye anaweza kasema mimi pesa sasa imenitosha hakuna hata kina hata kina Cristiano bado ataenda huko China kutafuta tu pesa Cristiano sasa ako, ako China anatafuta bado pesa amehama amehama Cristiano amehama bado yuko pale pale Hmm? Cristiano sasa hivi yuko China na the, do, the, do, do mchezaji ambaye analipwa ila nyingi dunia nzima bado yuko pale na anatamani hata ongezwe tena. Oh nasema ati uko na mali sasa ati it sasa you don't care. Wewe ulipata mali kitambo pesa hizi kakuchanganya. Oh kwani kwani akina Ruto wana pesa ngapi kwani akina Gashago wana pesa ngapi na bado wana, wanaweza kukuibia si watumie hizo pesa zao basi wasikate watu 3% si wana pesa na si anataka kufanya Kenya ionekane vizuri si mbona asitumie pesa zake bro hakuna mtu ambaye eti at, amefikisha eti pesa fulani hataki pesa zingine hakuna we ushai kuona wapi acheni kutupima bana mm amwezi mkatupima He also acknowledged that it was because of Raila that he managed to become the Langata MP. Kama unajua hivyo kwa nini sasa una una unabweka? 
ati akajaribu pia kuambia watu eti bado wame maintain urafiki na viongozi wa UDA I mean na viongozi wa Kenya na, na, na wa, wa, viongozi wa Azimio hata ukiwa marafiki zao kuna sehemu tu anakuweka kuna se, kuna two place wamekuweka tu kabisa wanasema huyu jamaa huyu hapa ndo sempake huyu aspite hapo akipita hapo anazuiliwa acha hmm. sasa wacha tu ajipige kifua kuna muda unakuja jalangu hata hata hey. ngoja tu ngoja tu hata hizo ay, kitu kinamwambia eti sasa muda utafika ehe muda utafika tu very soon na tutaona atafanyaje Anyways kwa wale ambao wana maoni tofauti jamani hayo ni maoni yangu Sijasema niko right unaweza kaa uko right so nipe maoni yako hapa chini kwenye sehemu ya comments lakini niwakumbushe tu wale watu ambao bado hawajajiunga na familia hii kwamba naweza mkajiunga ni rahisi unachotakiwa kufanya ni kusubscribe tu na uendelee au utaendelea kupata taarifa nyingi na mpya kila wakati bye bye